Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, YouTube. Ryan Engelstad here, it's Underdome, Minnesota. And I'm here with, uh, let's see, uh, blaster wraps. I bought on Amazon. I did buy it myself. Uh, so this wasn't a sample they sent me. I wanted to try it for the Kronos because I really like the Kronos. And just to see what we could do with uh, what it would look like not having to uh, paint. You know, just see what we can do, what, you know, what the, what the market is. Uh, it is on, let's see, this, where's the, there it is, 3M Scotch film. So it is high quality uh, sticker stuff. And it does stick very well. It does come in a nice little Mylar bag. Uh, it came in an Amazon padded envelope. Uh, if you look at, let's see, where's a good example? Uh, like here. You can see where there's cuts in the sticker in a couple of different places. You can see where there's uh, triangles or things taken out. And that is so when you put it on your blaster, you can put it around corners in such a way that, uh, you know, it kind of covers as much as possible. Now, this is your directions. I guess one critique I would have is uh, putting an order of stickers and when to put the stickers on in a certain order um, because like for example on this rip on the bottom this top sticker overlays the uh, very tips of this on both sides so it would be easier to put these on first and then the sticker and I could say the same thing here because this sticker overlays these two triangles so it'd be easier to put the triangles on first and then this one so it's just a little thing of putting an order of uh, sticker application on um, what else there are no holes in the sticker for the screw holes which is not a problem if you do all your modifications that you're going to do for the Kronos first and then put the stickers on last which you know in a way makes complete sense but just so you know uh, like here you can tell where the where the screw hole is um, so you could find them again if you wanted to open it up but uh, just so you know if you're going to upgrade the spring or take off the door or whatnot to uh, do that first so how does it look uh, complete and this is complete this has all the stickers on except for the uh, loading door which of course I don't like the loading door so I take the loading door off a um, little bit more orange on there I guess I don't, I don't mind that at all um, if you use your fingernail to try to push your uh, sticker down you will take off some of the print so that is from a sharp, you know, just using my fingernail uh, to try to push this in against the blaster as tight as possible. So there is, you know, potential wear on this, but of course, you know, it's going to, if you're going to use it, it's going to show battle damage. And that's kind of one of the fun things about having a history with a blaster is, you know, looks like a tool meter loving all his little dents. Uh, you know, every dent is a memory. Every uh, battle scar would be a memory. I do like how they made holes for several of the decorative pieces, um, but you'll also see that all the uh, nerf and rival and the whatever, you know, the number numbering on it is all covered over. But I picked blue and I used the blue blaster I thrifted, and I think it looks uh, alright. I'd be happy to reuse this in battle. And I think it looks pretty sharp. So, uh, as far as future choices from the company, I was wondering if they would think about making a multi-pack of colors. Not camo colors, just solid colors. And, you know, make it all different colors. Because when every sticker is different, a different piece... You know, if a kid wanted to come in and make a Lifesavers blaster and uh, make different colors everywhere, 
um, that would be kind of neat to have all the different options available in one pack. And then you can mix and match and customize it and really make it your own color scheme. I guess another thing would be having a pack if they would offer, like for a club, like for Project My Neighborhood or Thunderdome, Minnesota, in this pick, I would say like this sticker and do a run of just that sticker to put their logo on. I mean, not their logo, your logo on as a way of uh, either making it, you know, classifying it as a loner blaster or a club blaster or, you know, just as a, dis you know, if you're making them as a uh, reward for volunteers or something. It'd be something that you could do uh, kind of neat and custom for uh, your blaster. So, yeah, I dig it. I hope we see a lot more options from the company. Of course, we'd want them to uh, expand to uh, the Busbyverse and Dart Zoneverse and other blasters available. So I could see this being an easy one for the Knockout as well. Uh, be, being an even cheaper option, maybe get... A few sets, you know, instead of just one because the blaster is so much smaller. Uh, there's a lot of potential here for uh, for fun and and customization. So, all right, uh, it's on Amazon under. Let's see, where's that sticker? Blaster wraps, and go ahead and find them and support the you know another company in the community. So, hope you all enjoyed. We'll see you in the next video.